For many musicians in Midland and Odessa, Endless Horizons Record Shop has been a refugee for, or a refuge, I should say, for all genres of music. After last month's relocation announcement, sales at the shop slowed down. That's why many bands have rallied around the icon of nearly 50 years to hopefully keep it from closing. A benefit concert to fund the shop's relocation is set for this weekend on Saturday. CBS 7's Hannah Brock met with one band and has the details. Hannah? That's right. One of those bands is Roasted Crow, which formed about four years ago, but the influence Endless Horizons has had on their music goes back nearly 20 years. Ivan Borrego says the shop is a hub for concert tickets and obscure music. A 20-year customer at the shop, he still listens to the Blind Melon CD he bought there as a kid. Took that sucker home and listened to it, and I, just, I got hooked on it, and then I was like... So to this day, I still... Those types of songs and stuff, they still influence my music today. Phil Hodges' Midland home was filled with rock Sunday night as the band pondered the importance of supporting Endless Horizons. Like, I bought my first Frank Zappa album there. Uh, and then just, you know, some sort of like post-punk stuff I listened to when I was 15. And uh, it was really important to me. Hodges says there's a feedback loop between an artist and the music they're exposed to. For Roasted Crow, Endless Horizons is a part of that loop. The concert for the record shop is a testament to the strength of the growing local music scene. I think it's important, you know, to support each other and support local, you know, and support the people that you're around and, you know, have a community. For all the bands supporting the 48-year-old shop this weekend, there's likely a piece of their art that's rooted in a record shop experience. So this store is Odessa. This store is the history of the Odessa music scene, and we don't want to see it go away. Buddy Munoz hopes the strong support continues. You know, hopefully, you know, the, the faces that show up on Saturday will continue to show up, you know, for generations to come, hopefully. Tickets for the all-day benefit concert at The Vine are on sale online or in-store. The concert will start at noon on Saturday, and the last band will take the stage at 11 p.m. For CBS 7 First Alert News, I'm Hannah Brock.